We are at Hobby Lobby. We are gonna head inside to see what we can find and look at activities and some spring decor. We've got the whole crew today. They're all helping me shop. <laughs> oh, they got spring everywhere. I kind of want to get some new spring flowers. I actually really like this one. It's literally the first thing that I saw. They have cute little bunnies. What are these? They're like napkin rings, so you can put a napkin in there and have it on the table. We don't really use that with you guys because we would destroy them. <laughs> More like a specific summer one. Well, everyone. These bunnies are cute. Uh huh. Now I know where you get the paper stuff. <laughs> oh, the Easter basket stuff. Mm -hmm. Speaking of, I know where the Easter baskets are. They're pastels, so they would camouflage pretty well. Yeah, I have good, some like that, kind of. That Natalie wants carrots in a nest for her room. <laughs> that way it's like when the I like babies, this little bunny. Like when the baby birds. Which one do you like better, the nest or the carrots, Natalie? I like both. Hmm. Look. Which one of the oh my goodness, look at these. They have like the little canister beads. Canister? And they look like... They look like carrots. I'm gonna get those. Those are cute. Oh, get these. These oh, are big these. eggs and they have egg beads. Oh, look at this. How cute. I could use this to decorate my shelf. Hmm, yes. The fourth <laughs> is strong with this little one. That's cute. <laughs> A roll with it. They've had a BB-8. <laughs> That's cute. Together we shall rule the kitchen. <laughs> they have little... Look. It says snack time. Oh, they have Star Wars things too. Little mats. How cute are these? Java the Hut. <laughs> One is dead now. One is They have all kinds of garland. I love all this bright stuff, all this bright beachy stuff. Super cute. I thought about getting one of these big signs for the front too. These little decorative balls are cute. The girls are both getting dream catchers. Welcome to our messy, crazy, beautiful like that's us. Welcome to our messy, crazy, beautiful. I like this one that says welcome. You like everything. I do like everything. <laughs> I do love everything. I also that think... <laughs> yeah, it's, it's Isabella's. <laughs> Reading about Shocker's book. Yeah, that's all right. I like this picture. It's pretty. Okay, I think we're about done today, but we're getting ideas for the future. I like these tall signs like that. We're going to get this little bunny and a couple of Easter things to get us started and some bracelets that they could make. And here's what everything looks like on the front door. The cute little bunny up there looks really cute from the road. And there's a sad little dog face pressed up against the window. So in addition to the bunny the little door thing that I got for outside and also the doormat, we got a couple things for around the house, just some fun spring things. So Natalie actually wanted these little carrots for her room as a decoration, so we got those. I got this garland. I thought this was really cute. It's Easter garland and it is kind of carrot themed. That's really cute. All of this stuff was actually on sale. I got the 40% off coupon on my phone, but all of this ended up being on sale because it was in the spring shop. I got this cute little bunny to hang up. I got a number of these plates. I just really love this pattern. So the kids will use these for like pancakes on the weekends and stuff like that. I got this. This is my happy place towel as you can see i guess this was our theme of today and i'll put that on our stove area both the kids got dream catchers for their rooms and then we also got these beads so they can make bracelets and give them to friends and they got a couple little like hooks they picked out these iridescent hooks and we got these o-rings so they can tie one side of the hook one side of the o-ring and then there's some stretchy elastic in there so that's going to be one of their projects that they can do here at home, so that is our little haul 
of about, oh, it looks like it was about $65 worth of stuff. And some cute things for the kids to do, some cute activities, and a start to some spring items as well. So also on the way home, we picked up our Walmart grocery pickup, which doesn't look like a lot of stuff. And that's because I went to Costco yesterday and I actually got quite a bit at Costco. I got milk, I got bread, I got some dinner stuff and their juice boxes and just a number of things from Costco. So this is a really tiny grocery haul. Somehow it still ended up being $100 worth of stuff, like over $100 worth of stuff. But we had to get Cascade, the dishwasher packets. So those are like $20 on their own. But here's some of the things that we got in the grocery haul. Just an impromptu grocery haul. So I got ground turkey. We're going to do manwich out of ground turkey. And then this was a substitution, but chicken breast tenderloins. They just gave us, I think this is like a Walmart brand, instead of what we had on the... The thing, we'll do a chicken and the crock pot meal and I'll use the ranch seasoning for that. Some gum for my husband, my Louisiana tea that I'm making my iced tea maker, hippies, um, morning star, veggie, sausage, egg cheese sandwiches. There's a bacon lover's pizza. These are like the biggest, <laughs> oddest thing to have right next to each other, but Natalie really likes, likes those sandwiches. Um, cream cheese, this is also for the chicken crock pot meal. You can do like chicken bacon ranch. Here's bacon pieces to do chicken bacon ranch. Some salad, my husband and the kids eat that a lot. There's two almond milks, especially my husband and I like those. Only one yogurt, so my husband must have had already some yogurts in there or something. So normally he gets three of those. Um, some cherries, I get those for amaretto sours. <laughs> one of my new quarantine skills that I've found. I got some cucumbers, I'm gonna make the cucumber tomato salad that I make sometimes really good with some feta and some cilantro. This was a substitution, some crunchy granola bars. This is not the flavor he normally gets, but they gave those as a substitution. Some distilled water, a couple of apple juices, a grape juice, a white grape juice, and some syrup. And so this seems like it's not going to be nearly enough food for the week, but hopefully this combined with the Costco stuff um, gets us through. I have a feeling I'm probably going to end up at Target at some point because I know that they were out of his cereal and a couple other things and that doesn't seem like it's enough yogurts for him either. But anyhow, this is our little impromptu grocery haul. I thought I'd toss it on the end of our Hobby Lobby vlog. Hopefully you're having a great day. We are getting ready to switch over to spring. I have just a few little heart things over here, but I'm getting ready to put bunnies out everywhere. So I'll share that in an upcoming vlog as well. So thanks for watching today and have a great day.